all right guys uh, before going further i just want to push all this code to the github repository okay so let me first go to the github.com here okay if you don't have an account uh, of uh, github then just uh, create one okay it is a very simple process so when you have the account just uh, go to this uh, sign in and uh, use your uh, credential to sign in and you will be landed into this github repository i mean the github uh, dashboard so to create a new repository click on this plus icon and uh, say a new repository so here you have to give the name of your repository okay so for uh, for our project we will be saying um, great cart uh, django okay so uh, let it be public and create a repository all right so here are some of the commands uh, uh, git uh, github uh, uh, shows you so uh, let's first go to this code editor and uh, and okay let's go to this uh, uh, git bash now first of all we have to initialize the repository okay first uh, let's say git init all right so as you can see the uh, git folder is created now so now before running any more commands now i want to show you one more thing that is a uh, uh, git ignore okay so uh, first of all let's create a git ignore file let me tell you why this is important um let's create a new file and let's say git ignore okay uh, hit enter it should be in the root folder okay now inside uh, this git ignore we are going to mention all the uh, files or folders that we don't want to send to the git repository okay so maybe in most of the cases we don't want to send the uh, image files or media files to the github uh, you know the github repository because media files and images or you know the mp3 videos all these files are uh, uh, very big in sizes that's why we we don't prefer to send them to the uh, git repository so other than that we have a list of code here uh, let me show you let me take you to the browser here uh, let's say uh, git ignore dot io and go to this website and here uh, just say django it will give you the git ignore file uh, you know the code which is used for the django projects okay just copy all and uh, paste it inside this git ignore file okay now let's uh, just confirm uh, uh, if uh, the media folder is already included yes it is already included see okay all right so just uh, save this and let me close this one and uh, so far we have run the git init command right so the next command is we have to add all the uh, all our code to the git repository right so that's why we say git space add space minus a minus a means we are adding uh, all the files uh, you know all the code to the git repository when you hit enter it will take a little bit of time because this is the first time right so that's why so this is done now and the next command is we want to uh, okay so one one more thing i want to show you that is uh, uh, when you are installing the git i mean when you are using the git for the first time it may ask you to set up uh, your identity okay so when it is asked for uh, setting up your identity you just have to run these two commands okay git config global user username user dot name and your uh, name and the email address these two commands when you run it and you are all set to go uh, okay i'll go back and uh, uh, the next command is we need to say uh, git commit okay so let's say git space commit minus m and uh, let's say this is my first commit you don't have to remember all these uh, you know commands because uh, when you create uh, create a new repository it will show you all the commands right 
so git init if you want to add git uh, read md uh, read me dot md and all so that is fine okay but um, uh, for me i think uh, this is enough okay so now i'm uh, running this this command git commit minus m first commit so this message can be anything okay this is uh, just for the demo purpose so hit enter all right uh, so now the uh, next command is uh, this one okay so this one just copy this and paste it here all right so the next command is uh, we can say git push origin master or we can just copy this copy this and paste it here okay uh, okay so uh, here let's uh, just uh, do as it is and next this one so this command will now push all the code to the git repository we just created okay all right uh, so this looks fine now uh, i think everything is uh, perfect now let's uh, just uh, reload this page all right now we can see all the files uh, in the uh, you know in the uh, git repository now one more thing to notice here we don't have any uh, folder called media right but but we have the folder media here right but we don't have the folder media here okay so uh, this git ignore file is ignoring this folder all right so next uh, i think uh, this is enough for now um, let me cross check once so if you if you if you want to see uh, if there is any code to push to the github then you can say git status okay so now there is no uh, you know there is nothing to commit so if you change something okay so let me say uh, let me uh, just uh, do something here and uh, if i say git status it is saying modified template store product detail see this is automatically detecting this changes okay so uh, when we say git uh, you know git add minus a then it will add this changes uh, this changes to the uh, github repository right so that's how it works all right that's it for now in the next lecture we will start doing our card functionality okay thank you